So, World Championship Sumo taking over New Jersey this weekend. Yeah, let's go to the Prudential Center where the International Sumo League presents, and I love this title, Ryan Christopher, the biggest show on earth. <laughs> Yeah, and I don't know if I'm part of that biggest. Uh, you're about to see that we got some big dudes here this morning, some professional sumo wrestlers in the house. And right now I want to introduce Noah Goldman. Noah, come on over. He is the president of the International Sumo League. Noah, you're obviously not one of the wrestlers, but talk to me a little bit about how you got involved in this sport and why it's so special here in the tri-state. Uh, I got involved with sumo going to Japan over 40 years ago, fell in love with the sport, and thought it would be great for the world and the United States. And now it's great because you're able to promote that sport right here in the U.S. And we have a New Jersey guy in the house and the reigning champion right now. This is Sandstorm. How you doing, Sandstorm? Hey, man. Good morning. How are you? This is so cool because you're actually the very first professional sumo wrestler from Africa. You're from Egypt. Yeah. What does that mean to you to be able to represent your country here on this stage? Of course, it's a big responsibility, like being the first and the only professional wrestler from Africa I'm East uh, uh, when I joined the professional league uh, in in Japan after this I joined the professional league in the US of course that's way big responsibility but yeah nobody else but me to get it that's right but this weekend is big for you because you live in Clifton New Jersey talk yes. to me about training in the tri-state area and taking the stage right here in front of your hometown at Prudential Center in New Jersey really like I'm so happy that like I'm fighting here in Jersey, yeah. especially like uh, uh, first time in the U.S. to have a professional sumo league with, yeah, unlike uh, uh, um, with all the introduction with, uh, from Mr. Noah Goldman. Sure. Yeah, he, he, he literally changed the sumo into to another, like, another sport. And I was going to ask, because everybody has seen sumo in movies and maybe on TV, but a lot of people haven't seen it in person or yes. here in the States. So talk to us a little bit about why the sport is so special and what you think makes it such a powerful brute sport. Great. So, like, as, as you may know as everybody know about sumo like it's one of the oldest sports in the history so it's very traditional but what with the sumo what we're having in two days is the traditional sumo but in a new suit ah. like which will fit all the generations the young young people like all the generations like it, they, they will be interesting to to see sumo very hopefully great. we'll be waiting for you as well too uh, i'm about to be there but i i just have my, my mawashi it's called is that it yeah this called mawashi mawashi, mawashi. is like japanese men built sumo built yeah. so you can touch it okay yeah. huh? There it is. I just touched his mawashi. But now, Curtin Row, back in studio. I just want to show you the strength of Sandstorm. So, Sandstorm, oh, I'll let you do what you do best. Oh, and Curtin Row, we'll send it back oh, on in studio to you. Monday. Make sure to get your ticket. Make yeah. sure to cheer for Osunara. She's the one and the only champion, guys. See you on Sunday. <laughs>